Hi, this is Snatch Hatch from BoardAtWork.com, and here we are bringing to you the Fidelio from Philips. This is a sound bar, but it does have a slight treat to it in that it comes with detachable speakers. It's a uh, surround sound system that comes in the form of a sound bar, which we're going to show you a little bit more. In right. this system, it has the detachable speakers, as you can see. All it has is the power on the side as well as marks for left and right as far as that goes. When you flip it around you can see that it's got the hook to hang it on the wall as well as the button to sync and turn it on. Um, these will have about a four to six hour battery life or whenever the sound bar goes to sleep you do have to turn them on separately if they're not plugged in on here. As you can see here we do have two inputs for HDMI and one out as well as optical in. We have um, the component and channels in as well as a single 3.55 millimeter jack. With this you also get the subwoofer. It's a column sub versus say your typical floor sub or um, under seat type sub. Take a look from behind. You can see it's got the power cord so you do have to keep it close to power as far as that goes. Um, and then you've got the connect button here to help sync it up with your system when you first turn it on. You only have to do is sync it up once, so long as you don't lose power or anything, it keeps synced and stays and strong. And finally, your remote. Uh, you, it comes with all the standard features that you'd want, up, down, volume with mute, but you can also adjust your treble and bass, which I recommend you do right away to find your comfort level. Um, it took us about a week of playing with it here at the Board at Work universe to find the correct level of bass and treble. Um, usually we went with three quarters of a way for bass up and treble all the way up. Um, you can also see that it has instant Bluetooth connectedness, so you can press the Bluetooth button there. Um, power button at the top with the HDMI buttons, uh, coax, uh, auxiliary, audio in, uh, all your different connective, uh, all your different connective bits right there. Uh, we found that it's easiest instead of tur you turning it on just hitting the optical button and having it turn on that way just because it can be a little fussy at times. Takes uh, standard batteries, uh, AAA batteries that do come with it. And now let's give you a little taste of the sound for this. We've got some commercials queued up. Now the difference is, is when you pull off one of the speakers, it will start picking up the remote sound. And you can hear the slight difference as it goes to surround sound. But you have to detach both speakers to do that. Now overall, the sound quality on this is very solid. Uh, if you are a person that likes watching a lot of movies, this is a, probably one of the better systems for the price for you. As you can see, the price is listed at the bottom here. Uh, it is a good surround sound, not true surround sound, but a simulated surround sound that you can get from a simple bar and change it to a, a 3.1 speaker system. Uh, overall, we enjoyed having it here at the Board at Work universe. Uh, it, it was especially great for uh, TV shows like uh, Talk, uh, Walking Dead and things like that, we could get really wrapped up into the program and, as well as it's great for movies. Uh, so this is Snatch Hatch from Board at Work saying thank you and always enjoy your entertainment.